In the name of Jesus Christ, our God and Lord, strengthened by the intercession of the Immaculate Virgin Mary, Mother of God, of Blessed Michael the Archangel, of the Blessed Apostles Peter and Paul, and all the saints, we confidently undertake to repulse the attacks and deceits of the devil. God arises, his enemies are scattered, and those who hate him flee before him. As smoke is driven, as wax melts before the fire, so the wicked shall perish at the presence of God. Behold the cross of the Lord, flee bands of enemies. He has conquered the lion of the tribe of Judah, the offspring of David. May your mercy, Lord, descend upon us. Praise our holy. O Saint Michael the Archangel, be our defense against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do you, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, bind into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who roam throughout the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. We drive you from us, whoever you may be, unclean spirits, all satanic powers, all infernal invaders, all wicked legions, assemblies and sects, in the name and by the power of our Lord Jesus Christ. We drive you from us, whoever you may be, unclean spirits, all satanic powers, all infernal invaders, all wicked legions and assemblies, in the name and by the power of our Lord Jesus Christ. We drive you from us, whoever you may be, unclean spirits, all satanic powers, all infernal invaders, all wicked legions, assemblies, and sects, in the name and by the power of our Lord Jesus Christ. May you be snatched away and driven from the church of God, and from the souls made after the image and likeness of God, and redeemed by the precious blood of the divine Lamb. Most cunning serpent, you shall no more dare to deceive the human race, persecute the church, torment God's elect, and sift them as wheat. The Most High God commands you. He with whom in your great insolence you still claim to be equal, who will have all men to be saved and to come to the knowledge of the truth. God the Father commands you. God the Son commands you. God the Holy Ghost commands you. Christ, God's Word made flesh, commands you. He who to save our souls humbled himself, becoming obedient even unto death. He who has built his church on the firm rock and declared that the gates of hell shall not prevail against the church because he will dwell with her all the days even to the end of the world. The sacred sign of the cross commands you, as does the power of the mysteries of the Christian faith. The glorious Mother of God, the Virgin Mary, commands you. She who by her humility and, and from the first moment of her immaculate conception crushed your proud head. The faith of the holy apostles Peter and Paul and of the other apostles command you. The blood of the martyrs and the pious intercession of all the saints command you. Thus, cursed dragon and you diabolical legions, we adjure you by the living God, by the true God, by the holy God, by the God who so loved the world that he gave his only son, that every soul believing in him might not perish but have life everlasting. Stop deceiving human creatures and pouring out to them the poison of eternal damnation. Stop harming the church and hindering her liberty. Vade Satana! 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 Vade 
Satana, inventor and master of all deceit, enemy of man's salvation. Give place to Christ in whom you have found none of your works. Give place to the one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church acquired by Christ at the price of his blood. Stoop beneath the all-powerful hand of God. Tremble and flee when we invoke the holy and terrible name of Jesus. This name is causes hell to tremble. This name to which the virtuous powers and dominations of heaven are humbly submissive. This name which the cherubim and seraphim praise and ceasingly repeating, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord, the God of armies. O Lord, hear my prayer. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. God of heaven, God of earth, God of angels, God of archangels, God of patriarchs, God of prophets, God of apostles, God of martyrs, God of confessors, God of virgins, God who has power to give life after death and rest after work, because there is no other God than you, and there can be no other. For you are the creator of all things, visible and invisible, of whose reign there shall be no end. We humbly prostrate ourselves before your glorious majesty, and we beseech you to deliver us through your power from all the tyranny of the infernal spirits, from their snares, their lies, and their furious wickedness. Deign, O Lord, to grant us your powerful protection and to keep us safe and sound. We beseech you through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. From the snares of the devil, deliver us, that your church may serve you in peace and liberty. We beseech you, hear us, that you may crush down all enemies of your church. We beseech you, hear us. prayer. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, by the power of the Holy Spirit, we pray that the cleansing power of the precious blood of your Son come upon us right now. Purify us and wash us clean with the blood of Jesus from the top of our heads down to the very soles of our feet. Let this blood penetrate the very marrow of our bones to cleanse us from any entanglement from whatever spirit we have come in contact with during the course of our intercession. Anoint us with the gifts of the Holy Spirit and refresh our body, soul, and spirit. And may the sign of your Holy Cross drive away all evil spirits from us in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. 